Yeah, it's uh, it's it's sad that only eight percent succeed in their first three years in this industry. It's Ridiculous. just awful. And and the biggest reason insurance agents fail, it, it's simple. They don't get in front of enough people. Mm. You don't get in front of people, you don't make enough sales. I don't care if it's insurance, real estate, whatever it is, yeah. right? You, we don't make enough people. Yeah, we don't make enough sales, you don't make enough money, we don't mm -hmm. make enough money, you can't pay your bills. Mm -hmm. And when you can't pay your bills, you do something that starts with a Q, which mm -hmm. is quit. Yeah. That's what most people do. And so we're flying around the country and driving and everything else, doing all these free live trainings for agents. Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes we'll have 20 in the room, sometimes we'll have 80, right? Mm -hmm. And the focus is when we do those, it's making those concepts, right? Those yes. complicated concepts simple yes. and actually giving them tangible training efforts to get in front of more people. Yes. Whether it's prospecting, marketing, sales tips, phone skills, mm -hmm. objections, mm -hmm. right? All those things. Absolutely. Because insurance can seem super complicated, mm -hmm. right? But if, if, if I could figure it out at 19 <laughs> when I couldn't, I couldn't spell the word insurance. I had no sales experience. I yes. listened to Brian Tracy's article in the sale every day. Yes. And I had no product knowledge, really. Yes. Then I really believe anybody can do it. And so mm -hmm. I, I went out my first year really focused on, okay, I'm going to just sit down with 10 people every week, mm -hmm. right? And mm -hmm. I'm going to just figure out how to do it, right? So yes. I, I was in a situation where they said, hey, you know what? Um, you, you, you can't buy, you know, you just don't buy leads, right? So I'm like, okay, well, I got to get in front of people. Cause that's sure. kind of how you make money in the insurance business or in sales. Right, right. So how am I going to do that? Mm. So I did something a little unique. I brought over college kids every mm. Monday night and did call nights. Gave hmm. them a script, data list, phone, pumped them up, gave them uh, cash when they said appointments, gift cards along the way, called with them because you have to lead by example. Yes. And I would walk out of there with a complete schedule full because I was creative and did something. Yes. Um, yes. I also door knocked a lot. You know, mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, cold calling door knock isn't the best form to make to make insurance sales. But you know what? If you're young and you don't have a database of people that are buying and selling, there are very yep. few things you can do to get in front of that amount of people in that short time. Exactly. And, mm. and I learned, okay, you got to put forth some activity. You can't sit on your hands, talk at the water cooler and hang out with the people in the office, right? Yeah. That's not going to make me any money. Yeah. And so that's the big thing we teach is activity, having a target, having a goal, breaking it down. Know how many leads you need per week or how many dials you got to make to make 170K yes. in eight months, you know, yes. whatever it looks like. Get down. I mean, that's, we, we were on a retreat in mm -hmm. Phoenix. Mm -hmm. And I spent some time with a 22 year old mm -hmm. and we built a specific strategy plan to help him make 170 mm -hmm. grand the last eight months of 2019. Mm -hmm. He's on pace because he now he knows exactly what to do and it's up to him to go do it. Yes, absolutely. Mm -hmm.